Are you excited for me? Oh, come on! Yeah, Michael! I might get a new car, what do you think? Well, a used car, but that's a big moment. Absolutely! Alright, so I'm pretty excited about this. I've uh, been looking for a car for a few months now. And probably the biggest problem, I was just looking at Hondas. I was looking for Hondas, Hondas, and kind of realized they're kind of overpriced for, you know, some, some of the ones that I was looking at. People wanted too much, and so today I just decided for whatever reason to look up Toyotas. And this, this one stuck out, and I think she's the one. So, here we go. We'll, we'll find out. How do you say here, Tour Corolla. It's only got 50,000 miles on it, but it just looked clean. And it just kind of stuck out. It's kind of far because it's in Rockland, but... 50,000 miles. I'm pretty excited, so... Here we go. Here's uh, all the cash. Hey yo, so, alright, so I'm editing this right now, I'm looking at the film, it's like 11, 11.38. Three grand's not a lot of money, but it was all the money that I earned. I earned this, I bought this car, it's all my money. I'm not showboating, I don't have that much money, but I just wanted to capture the moment, I wanted to capture my excitement for buying this car. I mean, this is the biggest purchase of my life, besides college, which I didn't really pay for initially so this is the biggest purchase of my life so just want to say that just quick now all right back to the video mr brown i gotta get the thumbnail shot you know michael hurry for the will you yay first card good go. luck let's go No, it was a standard. It was a three speed standard. Yeah. It filmed me. <laughs> Let's get it, get the story. Though. And uh, my friend just told him his father's station wagon had a 4302 in it. So I pulled out the engine transmission out of the Mustang and used that engine. Then I got a transmission from another guy up the street, a four speed, put that in. And the, only, the only thing I had to do for the engine is put a pilot bearing in the, the flywheel to convert it for you know, automatic so did, transmission. Did the clutch or something? Yeah. How long did that take the whole swap? Did you go app show that it's like traffic? The rest of the way? Or? Again. Not a lot of money, but it was all my money. Just got to remember that. Come on. Bear with me. Three grand is a lot of money. A lot of my money. Just saying. Just saying.
Poof. Poof. All right, so one part I kind of skip is the whole how it went down at the house. And the lady was really nice. Uh, she was Brazilian. Her name was Edwana. And she was really upfront. She was honest about the car. So the negotiation really wasn't much of a negotiation. Three grand is really a fair deal. And there was no really bargaining. We went in the house, we signed, signed the title, got the purchase price, got the odometer, checked out, every, all the paperwork was done, signed, and it was really clean. You know, no bar fights or any cash disputes. So, yeah, it was pretty simple. It was nice and easy. Um, overall, didn't get haggled, which was huge. Didn't get haggled. I bought it. Oh boy, come on, Kenny. Bow. liters four cylinders it only has 50,000 miles on it so that's pretty good that's a 2002 Toyota Corolla but uh, everything looks good the serpentine belt looks good um, but the uh, timing belt is chained so that that's pretty big got plenty of plenty of fluid for the winter the battery actually is looks pretty brand new so that's good So initial thoughts so far with the car. Uh, car is seems pretty solid. I haven't driven it yet. I haven't got it registered. I haven't got insurance. So I'm a little bit away from being able to drive this thing on the road, but I'm getting there. First part was getting the car. That was the hardest part. But uh, I'll have I'll put together a full review, a comprehensive review of the entire car probably this weekend or whenever I whenever I have all the paperwork done and set but as for now it's just kind of a preview of the car preview of my thoughts kind of how it went down so yeah finally got a car took me till I was 23 but I got one and it's stick and I'm gonna learn how to stick so I'm excited and it's all paid for so it's good Good job by you, buddy. Still don't know I'm going to name the car, though. It's got to be a her, though, right? I think for the first one. It's got to be a girl. I don't know what the name is. Though. You tell me. Comment below.